Hi everybody, this is Sweet Sweet Readings and today this reading is going to be for Pisces. Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus signs. So Pisces, your extended is going to be linked down below in the description box for the mid-month, okay? Pisces. Let's see what are the energies that pop out for you, Pisces. Um, do check out your extended. It's going to be about your person. How, how are they feeling towards you? What is the outcome of the situation between the two of you? Oracle card messages, advice, love notes, all that good stuff is going to be in the extended for mid-month. So do check it out. I'm going to be linking down below. Look at what fell on the floor. On the floor? <laughs> Over here. <laughs> Ooh, Pisces. Okay. So that is your own energy. I'm going to take it because this fell and it is looking like your own energy. So I'm going to take it. Um, so Pisces, you're getting the Ace of Pentacles, the Ten of Swords, and the High Priestess. Looks like, um, I feel like you're trying to balance your work and your emotional self together, Pisces. It's like you telling yourself that, you know, you're telling yourself that, okay, I'm fine. I got this. And then you're focusing on your work. And then you tell yourself, okay, fine. I got this. You know, I can handle myself emotionally. But I feel like where it is stemming, stemming from is the past, okay? Uh, you, you're feeling like there is a situation with a person that you cannot do anything about it, okay? You're feeling tired. You're feeling just like you cannot do anything to make the situation better with this person. I feel like you have you are now putting the work into yourself. Um, I do think you tried to make something work with somebody or you, you still uh, saw the potential in this relationship and you tried to take things forward with somebody, but it just like, I feel like it wasn't reciprocated or whatever the case might be. Um, could be dealing with the Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, another Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio maybe, or Earth sign is here too. I feel like, you feel like there's not much that you can do when it comes to this person that's that you're dealing with so you're focusing on yourself and actually i see you doing a lot of inner work pisces i see you being very focused on yourself i see you doing the inner work as in you're recognizing that you cannot keep um saving the situation when this person doesn't want to save the situation with you um you feel like it's better for you to focus on yourself right now focus on your stability and see where it goes from there so there, basically, there's a situation that you're feeling completely like you're not done with it, but you're feeling like you cannot do anything to make it better. You know what I mean? Um, oh my God, they're dropping things in the kitchen. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Give me more messages for Pisces. Pisces, look at that devil. Look at that devil. Um, tell me more about the devil card here. Tell me more about the devil card. Oh, eight of wands. I feel like Pisces, you just want to like get away from this. Yeah, you just want to get away from the situation as fast as possible. Um, you don't want to be a part of a situation where... It is basically like I feel like Pisces you want to get away from this person as soon as possible or as far as possible. I feel like you're trying to take your life in a different direction, but at the same time Pisces there is some like there is something that you really really want. Okay? Maybe you want to communicate with this person, but I feel like Pisces you're also like I'm going to tell you you're also um very focused on moving on from this person and keeping your options open, okay? You feel like you have been resisting the end. You've been, you know, I feel like maybe this person hasn't been very communicative with you and you've, you've been trying to make it work with them and now you've just given up and you recognize it. That's why you're doing the inner work. You're listening to yourself, okay? Some of you are becoming more intuitive maybe. But I, I think that Pisces, you're trying to feel good. You're trying to feel... You know where you want to feel successful when you can i feel like really you want to move on from this person because of uh how burdened you feel okay this is a relationship or this is a situation where you feel burdened and you want to get over it okay but pisces don't tell me if this person pops up in your life like you're not going to respond because i know you will 
um, right now I see you being very money focused as well. Okay, so you could be trying to save money or, you know, trying to expand your whatever the case might be, you know, your financial stuff. Yeah, bottom of the deck is the Ace of Wands. Oh, the Four of Cups in the reverse and the Page of Wands. I feel like this person is still very interested in you, Pisces, but you are the Queen of Cups, right? This person is the Page of Wands. They're still very interested in you, but I'm going to tell you something. I feel like this person has a hard time um, keeping their word. This person has a hard time sticking to what they say they're going to do. You just feel burdened. And I do feel like you put this effort in. Okay, I do feel like you did something or maybe I don't know. This could be just hope that you were lingering on to. Now you're getting rid of it. Now you feel burdened by it. I do feel like some of you want to keep your options open. Some of you want to travel maybe. Some of you are waiting to hear from them, literally, Pisces. Or if you're not waiting to hear from them, you just want to like... I feel like Pisces, you're seeking for closure. I don't know why I keep getting that in my head that there is something that... Pisces, you you want closure, okay? Um, you want two things right now. You want to be able to rise above the situation, but you want closure as well. <laughs> so, I don't know, where is that? What is that, okay? yeah look at that three of swords and the hangman so this person has broken your heart you're feeling overwhelmed you're feeling yeah you're feeling broken hearted okay and i feel like the situation hasn't moved forward with this person like maybe it did a little bit for some of you but for the rest of you even if it moved a little bit forward i don't think it really like it got to a point where somebody was passionately pursuing you it was more so like a stuck and stagnant situation um and pisces okay let me tell you something pisces the more you think about it the more it's breaking your heart okay how stuck the situation is how this person is just not doing what they're supposed to be doing i feel like you have so much love for this person pisces you're the one wanting to actually still take this relationship forward but maybe this person's rejecting you or not being completely honest with you or you know treating you like an option or something yeah death card with the empress you feel like you cannot do anything to take it forward and the relationship growth wise it's not really going anywhere i still see stagnancy but let's see tell me more about the person pisces is dealing with the sun and the magician pisces the thing is that you make this person happy could be a leo aries gemini capricorn libra pisces scorpio the emperor aries yeah um pisces i feel like this person wants you but they they just don't express that and when they do express it they take it back so they give you bits and pieces and then they take it back they give you bits and pieces and then they take it back uh but actually you really make them happy like you make them happy like nobody else like i'm gonna tell you that i feel like this person somebody who's very clever with their words like it could be a businessman or a woman i don't know they they're very clever with the way they they do things with you and they're very like intelligent as well so this person hides their emotions from you but gives you enough hope that you don't give up completely so they they like they're not making you a priority but at the same time like the kind of happiness that you give them nobody else gives them pisces who is this person They could be waiting on you to communicate with them. Could be a cancer. This person's also very work focused. I feel like they're not communicating with you a lot. Okay, they're, they could be waiting on you to communicate. Uh, this person could also be somebody who keeps things up in the air with you, who doesn't plan much. But Pisces, it's very hard for you to make this person do anything. Like they can make you forgive them but you cannot make them do anything. They just do what they want to do, okay? Somebody here is making another person wait, and I feel like it's them, but I don't see you putting a lot of effort into it because you feel like you've already put the effort into it, and now you don't want to do that. So this person's quite... I feel like this person... Um, um, Pisces, this person, I feel like they act like they're good without you. 
okay and this person is very confident and very like they're quite egoistic as well so i don't know how to put it up you know pisces this person i feel like they want you but they just don't tell you that but they don't pursue you like crazy as well so they just like yeah the pool in the reverse um pisces for some of you this person could already be maybe committed or something i don't know it does look like they are not pursuing you in a way you want to be pursued and then this is looking like uh with the chariot and the emperor it is looking like this person is very self-focused right now the lovers they do have love for you this person does have feelings for you sorry i got cut off uh but it's like they're not ready to take a chance with you they're not ready to uh, be fearless and pursue you or give you a commitment it, it is looking like they're not caring about it as much and they're not ready to give you what you want in a relationship but they have so much love for you they they do have love for you okay it is not that they don't have feelings for you they do but it could be that this person's already stuck somewhere that they're not able to pursue you or take the situation forward with you okay we will clarify this in the extended but for now it does look like they want you but they keep a lot to themselves as well that's causing or that has caused a lot of problems in this relationship okay pisces let's see pisces this person keeps tabs on you like nobody's business let me tell you that yeah, at the end of the day, you could be dealing with a Libra. There is somebody waiting on you, Pisces. I feel like this person could be waiting on you to make a first move, but I really don't see you making that first move. I see you being focused on yourself because you did in the past and they ignored you. So you probably won't. But I do feel like they're waiting on you for something. Okay. Pisces, right now, you're all about your stability. You're all about the balance, okay? You're, you're saving up money. Um, why do I have a sage mark on my hand? Damn it. Let me pick that up. I apologize. I was trying to cleanse the deck and I got sage marks all over my... Okay. So, Pisces, um, yeah, that's what it's looking like, at least. Uh, looks like you're focused on yourself, your money, your finances, your goals, your stability. Now, this could be your emotional stability as well. Because you are doing the inner work, okay? Some of you want to be in a relationship, married, and you don't want to be playing games. Like, you know, you just, you don't want to be a, in a friends with benefits situation. You want to be in a relationship. There is somebody keeping tabs on you like nobody's business. But I want to tell you that whoever is keeping tabs on you... <laughs> this is what you want them to be or this is how you see them with the king of cups but they're actually not that king of cups pisces um i feel like you really see them in a very like you're ready to forgive them you're always giving them the benefit of the doubt but who they really are is this page of swords in the reverse I feel like Pisces, it has been the same old, same old with this person. Nothing new. I feel like some of you already know that they are this way. Um, they keep tabs on you, Pisces. They put your name on that social media handle and, you know, they search for you. But I don't see the relationship moving forward. As of now, I see you being focused on yourself with the hangman. We'll see in your extended how this goes, but for now, it, it does look like you are focused on your career, your finances, your goals, your stability. And I feel like Pisces, you've had this, some of you have had, have had this like huge awakening that what am I doing here? This person has wasted my time for so long. What am I doing here? Okay, and I feel like this person's very focused on themselves. You are the one who has given them all the time in the world to do this, 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 and that, and they have put you lost, Pisces. And that's the truth. Like, I'm not even sugarcoating. I know it's hard to hear, but I have to tell you that. That this person is not what you think they are. Like, yes, they have love for you. But what else is there? What else is there? The Emperor is there. Page of Swords is there. The Chariot is there. Um, I feel like some of you were expecting commitment from them, but they were never ready to give you this. And they're not ready to take a chance with you or to, you know, I don't know. What's the point of feeling like the lovers like and then you act like you don't care? Like, what's the point of this?
Pisces, I see you. I see you being focused on your money, your finances, your stability. Okay, for the most part, at least. Yeah. Now let's see what the oracles are saying for you. The rest we're gonna clarify in your extended. Do check it out. It's gonna be linked in the description box. In that we are gonna be seeing um, more about your person. How do they feel? What is the outcome? Like I stated before. And oracle card messages, advice from the universe, love notes, all that is going to be an extended. So do check it out for mid-September below. Pillar of light. You are what? Okay. I was going to say you are. Your vibration is rising. You are the oracle. So Pisces, this is talking, I feel like this is literally talking like that high priestess. I do feel like you're getting your inner light back. You're, you're getting yourself back on track. Inner temple devotion. To, tune into the portal of your heart. See? So Pisces, I feel like you have a lot of love to give. Uh, and you're still willing to give this person that love. But you're not focused much on yourself. You, you have selflessly, if that's a word. So you've, yeah. Put this person before yourself. That would be the right term for it. If you've always put this person before yourself transformation but it's kind of like in the reverse i do feel like life is uh taking you through some transformation because it is looking like the high priestess god look at that i do feel like pisces you're recognizing that you're worth more than this or there is something happening in your life that is meant to be happening for a reason things are changing at a cellular level deep cellular level deep healing so i do feel like pisces you're healing yourself you're, you're taking a break But Pisces, that light is within yourself and you are searching for it, I believe at least. Trust your path. If you knew you would be supported, what would you do? So there's no need to worry. There's no need to feel like you're, you're being left out. I do feel like the universe has your back over here, especially with these three really good cards for you. That they, these all, all of these cards are telling you to believe in yourself, okay? That you got this. And trust me, you do. You do, okay? Now let's see what the Romance Angel Oracles are saying for you. Messages for Pisces and their person, please. Codependency. Somebody here is codependent on another person, could be you or them. Healing family issues. Love yourself first. Pisces, what's up here? Bottom of the deck, let go of control issues and deception. So I do feel like Pisces, you have tried to, um, yes, you have tried to control the situation and you've tried to make this person, you know, when you believe that you can change somebody, Pisces, you've been there, okay? Been there, done that for you, Pisces. You've tried to change them. You've tried to control them or make them sweeter or make them do something just because you love them. You've tried to show them how much you love them. But this person's deceptive at the end of the day. And I feel like Pisces, they're going to be the same way. They keep like, they're going to keep doing it. But we'll see how this, you know, t it looks in the future for you in your extended. However, right now it does look like you need to be putting yourself first and heal something maybe within yourself maybe maybe this is you who needs who needs that healing maybe this is you who needs to work do the work within themselves okay um maybe you've had a childhood issue or maybe they had a childhood issue i don't know somebody needs to heal themselves to be able to not behave like this in relationships if it's not you it's definitely them who needs to do that work but for now pisces this person being the same or at least feeling this way about you but not really telling you anyway that's about it those were the messages that popped out for pisces give this video a like and subscribe to my channel do check out your extended it is going to be linked down below in the description box we're going to be clarifying more for your person there and advice from the oracles and you know love notes all that so that's it pisces take care and bye bye